It's not a bad thing. I mean, that's their opinion. My opinion is, like I said before, I just try to be the best quarterback in the league. And I help the team win. So if I have to run, I run the ball. If I have to pass it, I pass it. Um, if I don't do neither and just kind of give the ball to my skilled guys and let them run the ball, then hey, that's what I do. But you know, my job is just to be the quarterback. And you know, all that label stuff is I leave it to the fans and the media. Um, I watched it probably this week, maybe five times. I uh, just kind of going through the game and just getting the feel of it and just how they play. But I didn't spend too much of you know trying to figure out what they did against us um, because it's a whole new year. Uh, you know they have a different defensive coordinator, um, a lot of different other skilled guys. So um, I was just watching to get the uh, get the feel of you know. You know, the speed of the game and uh, you know just how they play this indifferently and, and try to assume what they're going to do this week. Does it feel like kind of taking a test in that regard when you're watching the film, just you're watching the old test and then getting ready for it? Like you said, a different defensive quarter. Uh, yeah, you can say that. Uh, just because, you know, it, it's a whole different it's a whole different year and a whole different mentality. And so, uh, you know, that was the last year was our first time playing against Alabama. And so they kind of know what we what we do. We kind of know what they do. And uh, we just kind of, you know, try to you know, regroup and try to refocus and, uh, you know, try to you know, not go off of last year, but, you know, try to you know, have the feel of the game and what they what they kind of did and try to what they're going to do this year. Um, I mean, it's a... It's a good group, you know. I feel like last year they were they were very good too. Um, you know, this year they're the same group. Uh, you know, very very talented, uh, very physical, um, and do a lot of great things on defense. So, um, you know, it's going to be a tough task for us, and um, you know, we just got to go out there and play. Uh, a lot better from from last year, just because we have more depth, more experience. Um, uh, you know, we've been at this stage before um, in a lot of big games and, and a lot of pressure uh, moments. And so I feel like this year we have a lot more, um, just some, a lot more experience in general. How about you? Uh, what do you do for an encore after last year's performance in this game? Uh, just, you know, focus on trying to get the win. Um, no, I, don't, I don't worry about all the stats and things like that. Um, you know, I just try to focus on, you know, getting the, the, the final outcome and, uh, you know, focus on winning. Um, because, you know, all that stuff last year I did, you know, it, it's good, but at the same end of the day, you know, you want the W and be a national champion, and I wasn't, so all that stuff kind of go out the window. They kind of called you Alabama's kryptonite. You kind of view it that way, you've got some confidence, but you're one of the few guys that can have success against that defense. <laughs> um, no, I, I didn't say that. Y'all said that, so... Um, you know, I'm not going to put that curse on me. You know, I just go out there and play, and, uh, and hopefully we can get the results that we want. How do you think Alabama's defense will play you this year after what you did last year? Do you expect them to change things up a good bit? I don't know. I mean, they, they've, you know, over the past you know, six, seven years, they had the success, you know, doing what they do. So, um, you know, I mean, it is nothing that they, you know, should do uh, to change, the, you know, try to have success. You know, they, they're going to be who they are. And that's Alabama, um, and they've been successful at doing that. So um, I don't, I don't see them changing. Um, I see them, you know, doing what they're doing and, and being, you know, playing football. And um, you know, that's what got them here. So, but we'll find out Monday night and, and see what they do. Deshaun, you've run the ball quite a bit less this year. Was there a plan from the beginning of the year to stay in the pocket more, or has it been less so zone read calls? What's been the cause of that? Just uh, the way the defense is playing. And, um, you know, people try to take away the run game, so we'll we'll pass the ball. And so, um, and then when people try to take away the pass, we'll run the ball. So it just depends on what the defense is doing and the situation of the game, and uh, whatever Coach Scott and Coach Coach Elliott and Coach Sweeney want to, you know, feel like the game plan should be, and um, that I have successful for that week. You think you've improved as a pocket passer this year? I mean, I've. I've Passed for 4,000 yards last year. I'm um, almost 4,000 yards this year, so I guess that speaks for itself. Sometimes 
Not at all, because uh, turnovers are going to happen. Mistakes are going to happen. Uh, you know, you just move on and, and live from it. Uh, the great ones throw your interceptions too, so uh, things like that happen. Uh, we really break down the film. Uh, you know, sometimes it's tip balls. Sometimes the, you know, the receiver slip like last week. Sometimes the defense make a good play. So, you know, you only can control so much, and, um, you know, you just go out there and play football. You don't, you don't worry about making mistakes. You just play free and have fun. Are you happy it's Alabama? you going to face this Monday? Oh, of course. You know, they're the champs there. You know, the, they're the, on the top of the peak, you know, and, and they're the standard. So, um, you know, you just want to, you want to beat, if you want to be the best, you got to beat the best. And right now, they're the best. They earn that right, earn their stripes. And uh, for us to go be the champs, we got to go take it. Is it flattering Coach Saban compares you to Cam Newton? <laughs> that's really our job. That's a big company. Cam is on his own. A whole different animal, um, but you know, it's a, I guess it's a privilege and it's an honor. Um, you know, I really appreciate and respect the savings, so uh, you know, I thank him for that compliment.